How's it going guys? My name is Dave Higgins. Welcome to Sandbox Explorer. All right, um, so Northgard came out and I'm really excited because I've been looking forward to this and I've mentioned before, I think, that I'm a big fan of Age of Empires. That was a game I played on PC a lot when I was a kid and even into adulthood, I still played that from time to time. I got it on my PC, so um, yeah, really excited that this is uh, an RTS set in Viking, like times with Norse, Norse mythology and all that. Um, also, a side note, I've been feeling kind of sick all week, so I hope I don't sound like too sick, and I'm going to try to be more energetic than I'm feeling, but um, yeah, just a side note. Um, I've been playing Assassin's Creed 3. I finally broke that out because I wanted to play it since it came out. I got it when it came out, but I never played it, so um, I started playing that on the ride back from Florida, and um, it's been so much fun. I really enjoyed... Uh, Oh, I really enjoyed uh, playing it. The first time I wasn't like super into it, but this time around I'm, I'm actually really, really loving the, the game. So, yeah, yeah, I'll have a review on that eventually. All right, so Northgard story. Mo oh, there's a story mode. I mean, I should have assumed there was a story mode, but I didn't know there was a story mode. Let's player profile options and credits. All right, options. Scroll speed, English music, blah, blah, blah. Profile. Player profile. Thunder. Hugging in Mun. Oh. Bjarki. Clan of the Wolf. So these are chapters of the story, it seems. So, um. Let's go to. Should we do single player first or story mode? Let's check out... Oh my god, it looks like it's so much like Age of Empires. Oh my goodness. Let's do, um... Story mode. Let's just try story mode first. I am Rig, son of the High King Hargurorf, and this is my saga. It all began one fateful day. My father had gathered all his yards to make an announcement of the utmost importance. He looks we like the dude. Embark for the wondrous lands of Northgard. Riches, conquest, and glory awaited us on this mysterious new continent. He looks like the dad from How to Train Your Dragon. But the Norns have other plans for us. The one that's Gerard Butler. Dozens of armed men suddenly poured into the hall and put an abrupt end to our ambitions and to our lives. That's not good. They were mercenaries led by a man named Hagen from the clan of the Raven. Gonna have to mess him up or In something. In a matter of minutes, we were all slaughtered like sheep. Including the guy talking? All but me. <laughs> Barely conscious and vastly outnumbered. I had no way to fight back. So I feigned death. You gotta do what you gotta do, bro. I see that as he stole the map of Northgard and ripped the regal ah. horn from my father's throne, a family heirloom and the very symbol of our royalty. Bruh. I had to avenge my father and reclaim my kinghood. So this is awesome so far. I'm just loving this story dynamic and like the voice acting and everything. The art's really cool. Um, also, it's reminding me a lot of Age of Empires. It's even more detailed. Age of Empires wasn't quite as... It was still... They had like the voices and whatever. Uh, Exodus chapter one. Uh, we have safely escaped to a remote region. We must now reach the shores of Northgard. Bonus objectives will be revealed once you complete the chapter for the first time. Okay, that's cool. So you can go back and do bonus whatevers. Uh... Proud and noble at heart, the Bannerman of the Stag Clan is a loyal man who lives and fights with honor. Nothing masters, matters more to him than his people's well-being. He is faithful to you as his father was to yours and is willing to help you exact your revenge and conquer Northgard. So we start with... So that brand is the dude. Start with food, wood, and crowns. I'm assuming that's gold. 75. Hall of the Skulls replaces the Drury and produces additional fame. I don't know... What all that is specifically yet, but we'll find out. Uh, fame bonus supplies requires blah blah blah. You gain food and stuff. Dedication requires 500 fame. Upgraded buildings gain additional 10% production. Alright, cool. So, 
<clears throat> um, just for the sake of this video, I'm going to put it on normal. Even though it's set on hard normally. Uh, in extreme. I just want to see what the game's about for you guys. So, you know, if it seems too easy, I I'll change it. No but strength left when I encountered a group of runaways of the Stag clan led by a proud young man named Bran. Bran. Hagen's men had set his town aflame, and he had nothing left, <clears throat> not even his father, the clan's Jarl, who had died at the hands of the fiend, just like mine. Our common enemy had sailed for Northgard, over which he now had a map. All I could think about was finding him to avenge my father and retrieve the regal horn. We're gonna get it back. It's okay, we're taking it back. That's pretty cool. I'm a big fan of this artwork so far. Alright, loading up. Almost ready. It's getting there. I don't know how long. Okay, that's cool. That wasn't too long of a loading screen. Dude, oh, I love the music. Glad to see you back on your feet, my lord. I'm surprised at how fast you've recovered. I suppose Rage is an excellent healer. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, still, we've wasted enough time already. We must go after Hagen as soon as possible. Indeed, time is of the essence. Our camp is far from the enemy, but we are marooned in an unknown province on the outskirts of your kingdom. I shall prove myself worthy of their trust. However, impatient I am to get even with the scum, that scum, my priority is to ensure their survival. It's pretty reasonable. Very good. Your restraint does you honor. Besides, none of us will be getting revenge if we starve to death first. Droop. Speaking of which, there will be no shortage of mouths to feed, so let us seek out food. Wood is also a vital resource being used for both heating and construction. That's true. We must also leave the continent and set sail for Northgard. We shall need a proper shore to go out to sea. You are quite right. I suggest you instruct villagers to build a scout camp and start and train as scouts so they may be explore so they may explore the region. All right. So yeah, I start out with a few villagers. You're in a safe remote area. Your goal here is to meet the uh, basic survival needs of your clan. Food, wooden houses. Be sure to train scouts so that you can explore the region and then expand your territory by colonizing nearby areas. Find a shore to embark in search of undiscovered lands. Alright, so if you're familiar with like RTS games, then this seems like it's that. Um, I'm right in front of the minimap, so I apologize about that, but there is a minimap behind me. Um... Select zone actions and then build menu to construct a building. Select any empty spot in the area to place the building. Zone actions. So press A. And we're going to construct a... Build build menu? Build menu. Common buildings. And we want to build... Let's see. Scout camp. We're going to build a house first. Oh, cool. Okay. I was really, like, not sure about how the... Uh, placement let's just build it over here like how the placement of stuff was gonna go and i thought maybe having like this style of game where it's really easy with a mouse it makes more sense with a mouse generally speaking um but it seems like this is gonna work out really well as far uh, for the controls i guess we'll probably probably build i don't know another house because how many for more clan members. I don't know how many exactly. I know in like Age of Empires it's like five to a normal house. Uh, <clears throat> we'll do a woodcutter's lodge because you need to have that in order to get more. I'll we'll put it over. I'll put that over. Over here. Oh, I got. I got rid of some trees doing that. I don't know if I want to do Well, I mean, there's plenty of trees to cut, but, you know, the ones that are close by are always the best to start out with because they're close by. Um, town hall actions. Can I make a person? Organize a feast. It gives two, plus two and 20% bonus to all production and two happiness for one month as well. That's cool. That's an interesting feature I haven't seen. I mean, most of the RTS games I've played are just Age of Empires, so, like, I don't have a, a lot of experience outside of that. I played StarCraft and some other random ones, but it's been mostly, like, Age of Empires series. Uh, move to your woodcutter's lodge and assign them to turn villagers into woodcutters. Okay. Assign. 
Alright, I signed, uh... Why not? Two of them. So now, we need to build a scout camp. Oh, what else we got? Hall of Scalds. Train your villagers to become Scalds who will increase your clan's fame and happiness. Cool. Alright, so... Scout camp. Scout camp can go, you know, right over here. How about how about that? Doom, 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 doom. Now, where's my population? Six out of eleven. So do they automatically? I feel like I'm obviously I need to. Yeah, let's make a scout. Let's make two scouts. Yeah, fair. Thing is, I don't think you specifically control what the villagers do. You just choose what they are. At least so far, that's what it's been. So that's different, but that's fine. That's interesting. That takes a little bit of control away, but at the same time, it kind of streamlines what you're doing, I suppose. I don't know. We'll see how that works out. I'm used to with Age of Empires, you select a group of uh, units and you select their action, but... We'll see. Uh, to expand your territory, you need to colonize the new area using food. Move to the empty area and colonize it. So I'm guessing... You can build fields here and recruit farmers. Sorry for sniffling. Colonize area. So hold down X and that will colonize the area. Oh, and then they're continuing to go explore. Okay, no, I'm cool with that. That's different. Also, the music... Yeah, <laughs> I love this so far. I love the art. I love the way it's playing. Let's build another house. Training camp? No, let's build another house first. This reminds me so much of Age of Empires, and that makes me so happy. But it's like kind of like... I like this little section thing. Kind of like Civilization, but like different, obviously. Um... What do we got? Victory conditions. So reach the shore to the north. All right. So that's what we're supposed to be doing right now. Um. Common buildings, military buildings. We don't need those, I guess, because we said it's safe. But we'll check those out soon. So we got fields. Oh. Brand, my lord, reconnaissance of the area has revealed an abandoned cottage. Perhaps we should order a scout to search it. They might be able to salvage some resources. Agreed. We have to colonize the area before they can take, before they can explore the ruins. However, all right. Colonize and use your scouts to explore this. Blah blah blah. So we're gonna colonize the area. I like this. This is interesting. It's different than I was expecting it to be. A little bit. Um, I didn't know exactly what to expect. I just knew it was an RTS. But I'm liking so far how they're implementing the controls and the way you play the game. This new area is defended by enemies. Build a training camp in the military buildings to sec uh, section and turn one of your villages into a warrior. Okay, so cool. There is actually going to be some enemies in this. Um, do, 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 Training camp. Let's build a training camp, you know. Okay. Um, we want to build fields for sure. Like, like that. A food silo. Yeah, let's build a food silo, too. Got nine villagers. So apparently it automatically makes villagers, which is cool, I suppose. I mean, I'm fine with that because you have to, like, go make them constantly. September. Oh, I don't know if it's coincidentally September right now, but it is. You should prepare for winter. I should prepare for winter. Build a training camp. We're building a training camp right now. Can you have multiple people build it? Or is it just auto-select it? What do we got over here? Oh, some elk or something like that. Oh, a wolf. Who's that? Who are you? Who that is? Um, let's colonize this area. Oh, that area is defended? Colonize this tree area. Um, oh, it's defended from the wolves. Okay. Um, let's see. A sign, a sign, a sign. Oh, that's all I can do. Borhog, Borhog. 
And they're gonna go chill, I'm assuming, in the main area, the main camp area. This is like the hero guy. Let's check out this map. Alright, just to show you the map, that's what it looks like right now. Um, you know. Hi, I'm the map. I'm the map. <laughs> um, alright, so... Oh, is this area... I thought this area was defended by enemies. Holding armies button. Send your words to the area occupied by the foes. Oh, is that this area? Uh, armies button. Oh, ZR. And then send. Winter is almost upon us. We should expect food to be... Indeed, my lord. We should expect food to be scarcer and our people will consume more firewood in their homes. Our military troops will also be weakened by the coal. It might not be for the best time to fight. Well, you just told me to send... Let's make more woodcutters. Oh. Ha 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 ha. Colonize the area. It is now my area. It's our area. Can they get healed? Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, I should assign people to make some of that food. Some of that food. Got to make that food, food, food. Uh, build menu, common buildings. More houses. Can I not make a house? Do I not have enough? Oh, I have five out of five. Oh, okay. Hello. My lord, one, one scout claims to have found a suitable coast for the construction of a port. Excellent. We should colonize the area leading up to the shore so that our builders can reach it and get to work. We should do that. And we're going to do that. Um, we're gonna build. We're gonna build a house. Up in Mia. Oh, we're not. There's already enough buildings in there. We're gonna build a house. Was this Hunter's Lodge? Yeah, we'll build a Hunter's Lodge. How about that? And we're gonna build, like I said, a house. Oh, it's winter now. I. That was really cool. It's December. When did it? Did I miss November? I missed my birthday. Oh, you can zoom in and out with R. PSA. Alright, so we're still exploring the ruins over here. Alright, we're gonna check out something good in there at some point, I'm sure. Got people doing that. Food silo actions. Nothing. We can't really upgrade that. Oh, you can upgrade... The, I mean... The, Obviously. I wonder if there's ages in this. I don't think there... I'm assuming there isn't. The scouts found some riches in the abandoned house. Hunter's Lodge is complete. We're gonna sign that so they can get some... Some of that food. Because, you know, you need that food. Um, defense tower. I mean, I don't think we need it. Because I said it's a safe area. But also, who knows? We could get attacked. Um, let's build one. Because, I don't know. Let's build another house because I don't know. <laughs> Need more people. What else we got? What else you got? Um, scout cam, scald was to increase fame. Uh, healer's hut. Yeah, we need that. We need a healer's hut. How about here? My scout was hurt. How'd you get hurt? Did you get attacked by a wolf? Oh. What happened? Magazine? What happened? Oh. Hmm. We need more of them guys. I'm not sure how this works at the moment. Maybe I think each... Oh, okay. It allows you to... Oh, okay. So when you upgrade this, I'm sure you'll be able to make more warriors. Plan plus one more brand increase your warriors attack by 5%. Okay, so you'll be able to make more in it when you upgrade the house. And you'll be able to have stronger units too, so. Assign. Um, heal the warrior. Heal the warrior. Currently healed. What do you mean currently healed? I don't seem healed. Unless they're getting healed right now in the, in the moment. Healed his villager too. 
Erm. Um, oh, there's a guy. I'm under attack. Oh, by the wolf. I'm like, who's attacking me? Haha! -ha, we did it. <laughs> oh, I love this music. Happiness of paramount importance. Do not let it fall below zero. It automatically earns you new villagers doing so faster as it increases. Keep it as high as you possibly can. Oh, okay. So, um, that's cool. Your happiness is what makes your villagers get created. So, can we increase that? Oh, okay. So, we want to make a feast. Yeah, I'm down to make my people happy. Do, 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 do. Currently heal. Alright, everyone's Gucci right now. Do I have to assign people to that? I didn't think so. Alright. Alright, alright. I feel like we need more. Is this area mine now? Let's build. Another train. Let's build like two training camps. Oh, can I not? Oh, I don't have enough wood. I'll have enough wood in a mo- Oh, I need to make another, um... Woodcutter's... Uh, lodge. For sure. For show. Because that's important. In Age of Empires, going back to that, I would have, like, I don't know, dozens and dozens of, uh... I put unlimited population limit, usually. And I put just, like, dozens of, uh... Villagers just getting different resources. Because... That's how you get a lot of resources. <laughs> Alright, so let's make a couple of them, guys. Oh, we can't? Because our... Because we don't have enough people to do so? Where's the happiness? Oh, I have a two at the moment. Oh, it's, it's done. Alright, two more warriors. Two more woodcutters. And then, once we get that, we're going to make another set of woodcutters. Because we need those guys. Also, can we make more fields? Field actions. I want to upgrade this. Do, 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 do. Farmer and all farmers in this area. Oh, okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, fields. Okay, I need 80 wood so I can make more fields in here. Actually, I don't know if I can here because I think I have the maximum. This seems like... Uh, build a long sh ship dock. Oh, I haven't done that yet. I should probably do that. Oh, but I need to get through here first. Alright, so. We're gonna build. What is this? Hall of Skulls. Um, yeah, we need to make people happy, so let's make a Hall of Skulls. And then also. Nah, I should have probably made the Woodcutter's Lodge first, but it's okay. Um. Alright, so let's see what we got going on right now. We got... This area is explored. Can we get here yet? Colonize area. How much... Let's colonize that area. Um, this area is colonized. I can make a woodcutter's lodge. Yeah, let's probably do that. It's probably a good idea. Uh, I don't think the trees go away. Which is cool, because that way you don't have to worry about... Well, I mean, it is going away, but I don't know if it grows... No, it must, it must just go away. I don't know. Let's pay attention to that in a moment. Upgrade the building menu. 50 wood. And I don't know what that one on the right is. Uh, I don't see that around somewhere. So that's something. I'm sure I'll get to it shortly. Is it raining? Oh, it's raining. <laughs> um, what can we do with this house? Anything? They've already been explored. So it just has to be there. Abilities. No abilities. So there's abilities, too. <laughs> um, Alright, let's go in here and let's take on these wolves. Yeah, bruh. You ain't even. You ain't even gonna. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Alright, now that we get 80. Let's throw, let's throw a couple guys into the Hall of Skulls. Let's add another woodcutter's lodge. Let's not add another woodcutter's lodge because we cannot. But perhaps... 
We can add one. Oh, four happiness? Getting happier. Uh, oh, so you can only have one type of that building in an area. Oh, do we have anyone assigned to it? We do not. And now we do. Um, What else do we want to get? Training camp? Eh, maybe not at this moment. None of the scouts. Lodge. House. We got enough houses right now. Healer's hut. Food silo. What does that do? Proves food produced by specialized workers in this area. Okay, so... I kind of had a feeling it was in the area that the buildings affect each other, but I wasn't 100% sure, certain. Um, so... I guess we'll just build another house. Well, yeah. Whatever. And... Requires a scout. Do we not have scouts? Are they dead? Oh. I don't know what happened. They must have died. <laughs> um, Alright. So, go explore. Um, let's make a trading post. I don't know what that does exactly. I know what it probably does, but I don't know if you need another trading post to go to or if it just does it. Um, but I don't know. Let's make a scout camp in here. I guess. And a... Woodcutters Lodge in here. And also a training camp to make some more. No, we have enough we have max buildings in this area. Um who are these guys? Where are my people the to go build some stuff. You got some of them peoples around? Silent Villager. There we go. Here goes a guy. Alright, so we're all, we're all good over here. Wolves will spawn this area until you claim it. Oh. I claimed it. Wait, I didn't claim it? Oh, I didn't claim it yet. I need more food. Oh, I need to make that. <laughs> That's what I need to make. Do I have more? Can I make more houses in here? Or more buildings? I need... Requires fertile land. Oh, I need fertile land. I should have made it in here. Oh, yeah, they're consuming the food. Uh-oh. They're eating the food a lot quicker than... Uh, <laughs> a lot quicker than I'm making it. Can I change it? Can I get rid of the house? Well, that's not good. Um, we should probably go over here, then. Oh, no. The colonizer... Am I... Oh, no. Hmm... Can I make another thing here? Uh oh. Oh, trading post. What can I do? What can I do? I need food. Open trade routes. Um, choose to sell. sell. I want to sell. I guess wood. Can I get... I want to get... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Uh-oh. I need... Oh, man. I don't have fertile lands. Um... <clears throat> Well, everyone's gonna die now. Unless I can upgrade this, possibly. I require some unit of measure that I don't know what that is. Um, uh oh. 
<laughs> oh man, my happiness is like negative. Well. Apparently I got too focused on on wood to get food and that's probably something I should have focused on um, have max yeah sorry clan how do I can I get rid of a building oh duh okay well I should have thought of that earlier. I guess I'll get rid of... I don't know. Uh, I need fertile land, so let's let's just destroy that building. <laughs> Alright. I thought I had fertile land. What is happening? Made too many people. <laughs> Where Yeah. When your military units get negative thirty attack power when lightning outside, lightning outside of your territory, fighting outside your territory. Sorry, food production is. Oh, I made it to a new year somehow. So now we need to get some food. Hey, plus one, now that we're like almost completely dead. So is the land fertile now that it's summer? I don't understand. Well, I'm trying to produce more food. Man, I don't know. Where, who, who do we have? Where do we have people? I overpopulated my area and didn't consider my resources very much. Also, what about the Hunter's Lodge? Hunter's Lodge. What are you doing with your life? Your woodcutters? I don't know. Yeah, man, you gotta go. You gotta go hunt some food. It's probably more important than wood right now. I got enough wood to last a little bit longer. Um, oh, what are you doing? You're probably also cutting wood. No, you gotta go. You gotta go make some food. Really straddling the line right now. But we only have seven people. I feel like. Frech. <laughs> We're bouncing back. Um, so we need <laughs> 200 food, which we don't have. I'm almost thinking about just starting this over because I feel like it'll be easier. But uh, at the training post, I feel like I should be able to buy... Guess not. Dude, don't sell. Oh, you have to meet clans. Okay. That's what I thought. That made more sense. Um, alright. Scout camp. What is this? Woodcutter. What are you doing? Yeah, you should probably hunt food, too. That's what we're gonna focus on. Alright, cool. Getting some food. Bringing it back. Sorry for sniffling so much. Like I said, I'm I'm feeling really not good, but I'm trying to act like I'm feeling good. <laughs> Therefore, maybe feeling kind of good. I don't know. Uh, 
do 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 do. All right, so now the rub is that it is. I don't understand why I can't make another farm, another f set of fields though. Improves. Oh, can I make two of these? No, I can't. I can only make one. Can I put one in here? Nope. Um, is anything else useful to have? Probably not. What's in here? Um, I guess I can take another house away. And I can add... I can add a silo. So that will hopefully make the food. Oh, okay. Healing, I'm guessing requires food, but we're gonna just do it because we need people to be alive. Alright, we got plus 12 food going on now, so that's okay. Summer, make sure to stock up on food for the upcoming winter. Yes, I have noticed that, because last winter wiped out, like, my entire clan. We were doing really good in year two, but year three kind of, or year one, year two kind of messed us up in the winter time. Alright. We're approaching... Oh, huh. I wonder how... Maybe the wolves have spawned here and once in a while and they messed us up. Um, I'm reluctant to spend all this right here, but I kind of need to because now there's no more wolves that are going to spawn and now we can, we're one step closer to here. I'm assuming I'm going to need at least 250 food to get over here. Yeah. But, now that we're getting some actual food production, um, yeah. Oh man, can I explore this? I need a scout to do that. I'm gonna make a scout. Because there could be food in there. That would be good. Assign to here. Is this a scout's house? Requires upgraded town hall. Oh! Upgrade town hall. I don't know what that is yet. It probably don't. It probably doesn't let you upgrade it uh, in the first like tutorial stage, basically. All right. So now, explore those ruins. Let me know what's in there. It's August, so we still got a little bit longer until winter. If I can get, <laughs> if I can get this zone, then. It might be like right before the winter hits, so it could be kind of bad. <laughs> but also, it might work out. Alright, so we got 13 population. I guess now I can assign some woodcutters. Although, I still have plenty of wood. I don't know if the population is like. They, they're just stockpiled and you don't feed them until you actually assign them to something. I can't quite tell, but plus 14. I don't know what that is also. Is that per minute? Per something? It seems like it's quicker than that. Uh, defense tower. I could make a defense tower for, for the heck of it. Yeah, wh why not? Let's build a defense tower just for the heck of it. And then, in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 250. Um, colonize the area. Alright, and now I'm going to let as much food build up as necessary. <laughs> Wood and gold! Or Crooks, croons, whatever they call it. Yeah, let's build that dock. There we go. Hooray! <laughs> I thought I, was, I stuck it out. I thought about starting it over, but you know what? I stuck it out, and here we are. We're at the dock. Uh, we only have 15 people. We lost. We lost a lot of a lot of our villagers. But actually, I'm really liking that you make villagers, or the villagers are like created. And then you assign them to different tasks instead of making those specific. So you can like unassign them and make them do different things. 
I like that. That's a, an interesting way to, to implement the uh, your armies, your villagers, your whatever in the game. Uh, forest actions. Oh, it's a healer's hut. Oh, we do need to have someone in the healer's hut. Oh, we have two people in there. Oh, that's fine. That's important, right? Let's heal that farmer and let's heal that hunter. And let's just let's just heal everyone. All right, we we got happiness of five now, so that's good. Um, what else do we want over here? Is it fertile land? Oh my god, why is there only enough fertile land for one? I need more food. What about like a hunter's lodge? Was that available? No. Requires deer. I guess I guess that makes sense. Hooray, I did it. I, I focused too much. I always do that with resources and games. Uh, at last, thanks to your efforts, something happened and it cut the dialogue. Anchors away, proud Vikings. We sail for Northgard. Your end draws near Hagen. <laughs> oh! Cool. Alright, so now we're crossing the sea. Foothold, Chapter 2. Let's see. So now you can go back and also acquire a minimum of 500 food. D did not do that. Um, explore all abandoned houses. Okay. And we built a longship dock before year 3. Hey, we did that. Oh, so okay, I didn't do too bad then, apparently. Because uh, apparently that's a bonus objective. So. Um, yeah. My companion's eyes were shining with ambition. They were eager to set foot on the untamed lands of Northgard and reap its wonders. But my heart was tormented by a darker appetite. Vengeance. Hmm. Here's to that. Alright. What does it say? Carving something. Jake's. I see Jake's. Having trouble reading that. Um yeah, I'm enjoying this a lot. Um, this is a lot of fun. This is like bringing back nostalgia, sort of, to a degree, because of Age of Empires, which takes place in like ancient times. So there were Vikings in one of them, um, but it's different. Also, the music reminds me of it. Oh, longships! Or Viking longships. Dude. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so great. Uh, land ho, finally, and then it cut it out. My lord, we have dismantled our longships and used the scrap lumber to build a town hall on the shore. There is no turning back now. Thank you for your dedication. We await your orders to claim the region and expand our clan. There is much to be done. We colonized the surrounding area to expand our living space and find resources. And we need to raise our fame if we hope to stake a rightful claim in the region. Yeah. Uh, please stay safe and lead us to victory, my lord. I like that the fame is part of it, because, like, Vikings, that was a big part of their, like, whether or not you can be the king or the jarl. Um, Clan the Stag enjoys extra resources as it develops and thrives. They also excel when it comes to happiness and fame. That's good. So take advantage of these assets to expand in peace. Zone actions and build menu to construct the building. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, bruh. Alright, so, let's make a house, first of all. Yeah. Build a house. Build a house in a woodcutter's lodge. And... Uh, a scout camp. So I feel like these are going to be probably the three most basic buildings that you make at first. And then I'm going to need to make, um... I'm gonna need to make some fields ASAP. Like yesterday. Alright, so we got enough to make some more people. Let's cut some wood, bruh. Let's, uh. Let's assign some people to that. Also, I don't see if it tells me the max in an area for the houses. I'm assuming it has that somewhere, but. Maybe it's only when you access it. Military buildings, common buildings, uh. 
Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, longship dog. So is loot, croons, lore, veins, add lighthouse to explore great trade routes. Trading post, marketplace, training villages become merchants. Uh, forge. Oh, you can make better weapons. Let's make a dock. What does the dock say? Alright. Let's... Yeah, calling as the area, because this is where we can get some food. Zone actions. Oh, I gotta wait. I gotta wait now. It's May. Let's call them as this area too. Alright, so we can make a hunter's lodge. And we're going to make a hunter's lodge. We're also going to make a food silo so we can make more food in the area. Because food is super, super important. have enough wood. I think I just have enough wood to make a woodcutter's lodge. So we're going to do that. And we're losing food fast already. We can't get over here yet until... Oh, can we fish? Ooh, I need that. So we're going to need to make... Ooh, what happened? Uh, what is this wretched creature? Could that be a Draugr? Oh my god, this Draugr is... Oh my god, it's like Skyrim. <laughs> I know it's like part of Norse mythology, but like... Skyrim. <laughs> I heard of these old men... Uh, I heard the old men's tales of undead warriors, but I never gave them much credit. Apparently I was wrong. At any rate, we should defend our people and slay this fiendish abomination. Yeah, let's just slay that fiendish abomination. Alright, so what we need to do first is get some food, bro. Alright, so we're on the plus for food. It's not going to last for long. I don't know if I should do just what they said. What's this going to do? Um, and let's see. Doodly doodly do. Um, I suppose the next thing to make is a... What's going on? We just discovered a mineral deposit. These come in two types, stone and iron ore. Both are important resources and both can be extracted by miners. Build a mine to train them. Stone can be used to improve our buildings. Iron allows us to make our tools better as well as to rearm a bannerman such as myself if they should fall in battle. Uh-huh. Keep in mind that a deposit is finite and typically holds little or be sure to make good use of it. Makes sense. Um, someone, someone want to build this, uh, this thing? Do, 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 do. I need to make... Training camp. Training camp for foosball. You go play foosball with your friends. Uh, my lord, we have encountered another clan. What shall we do? Are they with that scum Hagen? I don't know. Are they with that scum Hagen? We come in peace. I am Halvard of Hydrun, the goat clan. We mean you no harm. Please offer us assistance. Yeah, sure. Greetings, Halvard of Hydrun. I am Rig, son of the late High King Hager Hargaroth. <laughs> what ails you? My deepest condolences, my young lord. We too have lost much of late. Our journey went awry, and well, to be brief, we are now shipwrecked on a desolate shore. We have nothing left, and we shall soon give into the wilderness. I beg of you, help us. We lend you our. La we will lend you our aid. What would you have us do? I said that with the wrong inflection. Thank you, it should not be too much trouble. Yeah, just give me your resources, bro. Your warriors need only exterminate the wolves threatening our fragile camp. 
Yeah, I don't have any warriors, guy. I'm losing food. It's happening already. Doodly 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 doodly. Yeah. Yeah. So. So. We're gonna apparently. Alright, we got some plus food going on. It's July. I got some time to make some food. Here we go. We need this. We need this. Ares defend. Oh, I gotta send them in first. Alright. Did anyone build this yet? Do I have enough people? I don't have any people. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Attack! My ally's under attack. Damn, dude. Well, oh man. I don't know. I'll try to save you, man. Explore, man. Alright. Colonize this area. Now we're down to, like, no food again. But we're gonna get more food because we're gonna get this fishing spot. We need that fishing spot. Gotta get that fishing spot. Fisherman's hut. Build that. And then we need a food silo. Like. Like. Aura. We are... What do we got? What do we got? Yeah, let's add a couple more woodcutters. What's going on, lady? <laughs> Let's look at the trees. Trees kind of sway in the wind. What's up? I'm a big fan of the way this is set up. It's really good for like a console. Because you go from section to section and build stuff and explore and expand. And instead of just wandering around, which I like that style too, but this is like, I don't know, it's cool. What's L? Military group assigned. Assign nations. All of your troops are always accessible with the main military group. Additionally, you can assign part of your troops to subgroups. Brand warriors assigned to send to one B. So I don't know exactly what we're doing with that yet, but you know we'll do that at some point. Um, yeah, get some food, build a food silo, so we can have more food. Oh, we're gonna build a new house as soon as I'm able to. Reach 200 fame. Okay, so I gotta get some people out here. Send your military units to kill all the wolves and colonize eight territories. Those are the victory conditions. Uh, my scout was hurt. Well, explore that area. We need a healer's hut, but we can't really get that yet. We have maximum. We need more houses. Need to construct additional platforms. What happened? We've acquired enough lore to develop a new skill. Please choose wisely, for it will have consequences for our expansion and our survival. It is crucial that we study any runestone or circle of stones we encounter. It will allow our lore masters to gather lore and develop our knowledge. Alright. Let me just uh, build a house real quick. Alright. So, where do we do that? Abilities. Um, contextual actions. Child world info. Go to last event. Blah blah blah. Um, okay. Units. Victory conditions. Resource infos. Status icons. I don't know how to upgrade, even though it seemed like it told me. Alright, we're losing food. <laughs> it seems like no matter what, I probably shouldn't have built another house. Your clan can't grow because it needs more houses. Well, actually... Oh, here we go. Lord, sharp axes, weaponsmith, trading. Uh... Game plus two cruise production. Military's attack power by 20%. Woodcutters produce 20% more wood. Um, I'm gonna go with that at the moment. Oh. Reduces the amount of food necessary to colonize an area. Ooh. Uh, 
Am I can I do that one? I need more lore to get that. I can't do that yet. I need to finish doing that first. Um, oh, what is this saying? Oh, I can change what you can view on the map by pressing left on the directional pad. Oh, is it winter now? It's a sombre. Alright. Alright, baby. Training post defense. I need to be able to make more food. It's hard to make food in this game. What's happening? Stop hurting my scout! What's he doing? Trying to climb over a mountain and he's failing? Um. Oh yeah, I haven't even fought these keep people yet. Yeah, let's go kill these people. Kill. Kill. Yeah. Kill the Draugr. Well, my ally's gonna have to deal with it right now. Alright, so now I cannot... <laughs> I need to call that as the area, but I can't. I need to get food, but I can't. I need. <sighs> I feel like getting food is a little bit difficult, but maybe I'm just managing things wrong. Or not wrong, just not. You know, I gotta manage things a little bit differently. My territory is under attack. Oh, like literally right in front of me. Get out of here, wolf. I should probably build a def can I build a defense tower? I can. I'm building that. Oh no. And a healer's hut? I, guess, I don't know, I guess I need to make a healer's hut. Losing food fast. Losing food fast. Um. Well, I can attack that area, but where do we need to get to? We need to get to here. Damn, bro. Yeah, explore that area. Let's see what's up there. Healer's hut is complete. Yeah, get in that healer's hut. Two people can get in that healer's hut, I guess. Well, no, just one. Heal the woodcutter. Do, 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 do. If I had two, can I heal different people? No, I cannot. Alright, we're only gonna have one person in there then. We made it to the new year. Alright, so now, okay, so now we're not losing food as fast. Now we're gonna actually gain food. Winter time is kind of a pain. Your scout died while exploring the area. Well, so how many scouts do I have? Where's my training? Or where's my. Here it is. Scout camp actions. We have one. Well, oh, pff, do we now have zero? Oh, no, we still have one. That's like the old notification. Wah, wah, wah. Ahoy. 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 Can you explore? Oh, he is exploring. Oh, he is exploring. Okay. That's cool. It's like loading the exploration. Um, this warrior is looking kind of... Oh, what's this? Oh, Circle of Stones! They said, uh, train your villagers to become lore masters. Okay. Hmm. Uh. How do we train them to become lore masters? What building was it? Forge? No. Uh, scald? Light? No. Merchants? Merchants? Hunter's Lodge? Fisherman's Hut? Healer's Hut? Woodcutter's Lodge? House? Carved Stone? Oh. Carved Stone. Oh, that's, oh, that's iron, isn't it? So I need to get over here.
but I need to get 100. Well, I'm going to get close to that actually right now. All right, so I need to get this iron from this area first. Then I can build the carved stone, whatever, to make the lore masters. And that, so, all right. Hopefully that guy doesn't die. My scout has explored a new area. Thank you, scout. All right, so now 120 food. Got rid of pretty much all of our food, but... Once we get this colonized... Are those pigeons? Ooh, food, food. Oh, fields! Yes! Alright, that's the thing that's happening first. And then a food silo is absolutely happening right next to it, and then... Slaughter sheep to gain 80. Yeah. I don't know if the sheep get you other things, and it would be more useful to have them. Oh, more, enough lore to acquire new knowledge. Um, definitely want to reduce the food cost for colonization, like, for sure. What's that one? Uh, food styles gain 10% food production and bonus gain you plus. Yeah, that's the next one. For now, food is, like, my priority. Ruins actions. Uh, my ally is under attack. Well, I don't know, man. Fields. Oh, fields are complete. Assign, assign. <laughs> okay. We have, we have, we're looking for. Alright, I'm gonna throw somebody out in here to requ acquire fame and all that. Oh, God. Hey! Um, this is a house. I don't really want to get more people from. Like, I feel like this is, like, enough people right now, because otherwise I'm gonna get in trouble. Uh, scout camp actions. We got still a scout. Um, this is the training camp, right? We still got two of those guys. Two. Wait, what? Uh, we definitely need two fishermen. <laughs> what are you doing? Hunter's Lodge. Got two of them. So now, we can get... Oh, okay, I do need to build another house. Build another house. Build another house. Uh, where are we going to build this house? Maybe... No? Oh, there's only two buildings allowed in the area? What? Wait, what? I know. I know. Oh, in here. Yeah. My scout died. Well, I'll make a new scout soon. So, now that we can make more people, well, actually in a second, the house isn't even done yet. What, you haven't built the house in three seconds? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Okay, so we got those people doing that. Oh, uh. oh, do I have to make a quarry in here to get the stone? And then I gotta build this after because I can only make two in here? That's okay. Alright. Um, probably need another scout. More food. More food. Um... Let's, yeah, go in there. We need to clear the room for more food. I can colonize this area. Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, alright. Unfortunately, I have to get rid of that building. Was she, did I recover 30 wood? That's interesting. Um, make a quarry. I got that sheep if I need some more food, so that's good to know. Um, let's see what we got over here. 
Aren't they attacking somewhere? Where were they attacking? Oh, over here. Alright, colonize the area. Mm -hmm. Um, buildings, fishing. I feel like it's gonna just have it on the little. I like this little like things you probably probably want to have menu. Yeah, definitely want to have that, and we're definitely gonna have a food silo. And we're also gonna have. Oh, we we have sheep in there. Can you just sacrifice? What is this? What are you? More droggers. Draugr tombs. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> Skyrim. They are the nodes. Alright, alright. We got two of them. The healer. Which one's the healer's hut? This one? Warriors currently healed, so alright, cool. Cool, cool. Trying to get up to what is this? This is the fisher. No, 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 fisherman hut. Yeah, do it. Um, what's over here? Draugrlands. Can I go up here? Can I? Can I get up that way? You can't pay your building upkeep. One of your houses has been damaged. Repair it, or it will burn. Which one? Uh oh. Okay. Well, training camp. So now I don't have enough coin. <laughs> Resource management is important in this game. I mean, obviously it's an RTS, so that makes sense, but like, you know. Do, 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 do. Send your military units. So. Where's that guy at? Can I just send them up here? I think I have to, like, go from area to area, right? Alright, man. Now we got winter on us. Okay. Throw someone at the Circle of Stones. Okay. Throw a couple people into the Circle of Stones. Oh, I didn't do this yet. Yeah, assign them to the quarries. So then we can get the, that iron. You have enough lore to acquire new knowledge. Do it. Um, yeah, more silo, more food production. Increases food production by plus two for each food silo. Yeah, food. Although now I need gold, so that's like my next priority. Do, 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 do. All right. We're getting some food over here. We got some of that. What's up next? Area is not exploitable. Exploitable? Can't exploit it. But we need to get through it. Well, we don't have to get through it, I suppose. Doch, fuck. Doch, fuck. All right, so... Areas defended, so let's throw some people in there. Does it show? Okay, it shows how much is left. So there's 30 stone in there. As soon as they're done with that. As soon as we're done with that, we will, uh get rid of that building and just add another food salad so we can get more food. We got plenty of food right now, so that feels good. We don't have enough... Oh, shoot. I didn't even notice that was happening. Yeah, I can't keep my... I can't pay my upkeep. I'm trying to repair it. Why won't it let me repair it? No, 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 I need that. Oh, no. Oh, no.
Oh, two assigned to the trading post. I need. Oh, it's training camp. Uh, where's the trade? Did I not make a trading post? I thought I did. Trading posts. Trading posts. Trading posts. Wait, marketplace. Built. Fix it. Yeah, fix it. Fix it. Fix it, thank you. <laughs> Made it to a new year. Alright. Alright, so this is eradicated. Let's colonize this land. Now, is there anything in here? Magnificent, our territory has reached a substantial size. The population will be able to thrive here after we have after we leave for the next region. Glory. Glorious! Our clan has reached a notable level of fame. Our influence over the region is strong and our people's hearts are filled with pride. Well, that's important. I'm now a Thane. <laughs> Alright, so now I'm a Thane. So that's good. Oh, enough lore to get new... No, uh, firewood consumption in the winter reduced is good, but... Food is what we're getting for. Oh, trading was probably what I wanted to get next. No, uh, we'll, we'll focus on that one after. Alright, so now. My ally's under attack. Dude. I probably need. How do I get through here? Uh, let's see. Maybe I have to just kill everything in there so I can get through it. I probably should have gone this one first so I could just go straight. Oh, I gotta go up here either way. So no matter what, I gotta go through here. Um, and there's also stuff in here that I have to get. Uh-oh. I need some coins. Wait, I have coins now. Okay, cool. I don't know how I got coins. Is it from making the trading post? How come it's not... Uh-oh. Oh no, this one's very important. Well, it's a house, so it's not, like, very important, but it's also important. Fix it. Fix it. Um. Alright, so that... Trading post is complete. Trading post is right here. Assign... So I guess I'll make a house. We need, I guess we need more people now. Oh, yeah, we need to determine what I'm trading, right? Oh, I need to learn trading first. Do I not have anyone in here? Or do, oh, I have two people in here. Okay, cool. So they're learning lore. What's going on with this? There's still 10 left of stone in here, so we have 50 total in a moment. Is this being repaired yet? Come on, <laughs> repair it. What do we got going on over here? I'm under attack? Where am I under attack? Get over here. Get out of here. Get out of here, monkey. Get out of here, monkey. Fix it. I have coin now. Boom. Yeah, trading. Learn trading. Boom. This game is cool. <laughs> I'm actually really, really glad that I got this. I love this kind of game. I'm not doing fantastic at it, but I like it. Alright, so our buildings are now repaired? Yes? Okay, cool. Um, trading. 
trading. Yeah, let's go ahead and trade. We're trading not food. No, no, no. Wood. It says stone, not stone, not iron. We're not trading that. That is way more precious. I don't... It's not exploitable. What can I do in here? Yeah, let's go attack these guys. Oh, that looks like I can make I can make a I can make fields there. health. Oh, it's still fighting. Did I lose someone? I might have lost someone. Let's see. Where is our... Yep. It's okay. Alright, now... What's this gonna do? We'll colonize this area. Now this is our area. Well, in a second, this will be our area. And now we're gonna go get this area, because we want to make more food. Oh, iron mine. Iron mine. My allies under attack. Forge. Defense tower. Let's make a forge. Okay. Fertile land actions. Colonize the area. That's a lot. 330. So the more territories you get, the more it costs to colonize it, it seems like. Which makes sense. Fields, yeah, build. Food silo, build. Um, let's make a feast for people, although I do only have 300 food, but yeah, we, happiness is only at a 1. Although I don't need people that fast right now, I guess. Oh, that... Oh my god, that makes things go faster. That's obviously... That's what they said, but oh, that's so much better. Um, Only for a temporary period of time, too, but... I don't... I don't fully understand. Wait, what do I do here? Swamp... I can't, I can't get through there, can I? Uh, trading. Scalds will produce plus one crown. Oh! Coinage. Your merchants will produce 20% more crowns. Weaponsmith. Military attack power by 20. Let's do that. Oh. Um, yeah, let's make that building. Let's make the Scald building. Scald, Scald. Hall of Scalds. Uh, somewhere. Somewhere over the rainbow. Nowhere. Where are you building? Oh yeah, right here. Nowhere. Oh, so they produce coins. I didn't apparently catch that. Oh. Fisherman's hut? Fish? Yeah. I didn't realize that I bought this area either. Okay. Bought. <laughs> summer. So it's summer right now. Although there's snow coming down from up there. It's, it's November. Oh, it's not really summer. Um, it's kind of summer. It's November, and now it's winter. Here we go. Alright, Randy, here we go. My buildings are all okay. Seems like my buildings... What is this? What's going on? What do you got going on here? Uh-oh. Um, no, yeah, here, let's have a feast. Have a feast. 
Y'all happy? Y'all good? Advanced buildings. A lighthouse. Oh. I was supposed to have that in here with this. Oh, I can add it to this? Oh, snap. Okay. That's cool. What other advanced uh, slaughter sheep? Build menu. Oh, that's probably the only one I could do right now. Can I upgrade this place? I need 50 coins. It seems like I can. I don't know if I should. It's winter time, so food's gonna go quicker. I need to get past here, and I don't really fully get why at the moment I can't. Oh yeah, food, food, food. Make food, get food, do food. Um, I have zero, don't go under zero. Don't make me spend more money on food. Do, 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 do. Oh, is this done now? Yeah, so. We're gonna get rid of this quarry because we don't need it now. And. Is that the food silo? We're gonna build the food silo because we need to do that. And. What else? My ally is under attack. Well. Okay. Oh, yeah, fish. <laughs> everything, everything that's food, just go do it. Go make food. Wood is being consumed more than it's being uh, chopped at the moment, so we probably need to find a place to... go attack that land. Where do you get up there? Right here? Through right here. Yeah, through right there. Is that wolf gonna come attack me? Oh, I'm gonna attack them, that's why. Oh no, I'm unhappy. Don't like that. We can't have that. Oh man. Have a feast. Oh man. Man, they're really needy right now. Alright, it's, it's summer now. You all happy? Doot, 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 doot. Oh. What now? Okay, coinage, fur coats. Longer reduced. No longer have reduced power during winter. Increase your civilians attacking your defense towers. Value. Your merchants will produce some more crowns. Um, I'll do fur coats next time it's winter because, I mean, I feel like it's just summer, so it's like a waste of money at the moment. All right, so we can upgrade this, so I'm going to. Yeah, so now that this is upgraded, I feel like that adds more abilities. Yeah, okay, cool. So now we can add more, when we, when we can upgrade other buildings, then we can add more to them. So maybe, yeah, we just need coin for that. Why are you unhappy? Stop being unhappy. Here you go. Here's here's all the food, basically. You good now? Do do do. I'm not sure exactly how to make them happy. Do 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 do. Let's go attack that. Uh, ruins actions. Oh, I need 420 food to get this. So, ha 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 ha. Let's see, we need to get up here.
Well, I'm trying to get my guys up here. That's like the main goal. Is to get these guys out of here and help this guy out so he'll be on our team and we'll have a stronger army. Because like, I don't know, you ever watch Vikings? In Vikings, you got to make friends with people and then probably betray them later or get betrayed by them. But, you know. Colonize the area. Colonize the area. Let's colonize this area first. Alright, so now... Oh, we need a scout. I don't have any more scouts. Uh, let's make a scout. Uh, that was here. Scout. Can't assign one. Need more people. Need to construct additional pylons. Oh, I don't have any happiness. Um, we need to... Hey, listen, guy. Well, I can't make you happy now, so we're probably going to have a bunch of people die. I'm going to build this silo. I'm going to build this silo. Oh, thanks. Um, well, y'all going to just have to be happy. I don't know what to tell you. Scout. And then the scout is going to go in here. I thought. Oh, okay. Now that you're a scout. Now that you're a scout, go here. Explore the ruins. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah, I don't know, man. It's an, I'm gonna spend all my food to make you guys happy, or like, le <laughs> just apathetic in like a second, and then it's gonna be winter, and then you guys are gonna have no food. And you're gonna be even unhappier. So I don't know, man. It's almost winter. I need that fur coats. I need that fur coats. <laughs> Although I don't need my population to be higher right now. I don't know. I don't know, man. the warriors. The warriors are not in there. The warriors are here. Wait a minute. <laughs> My territory is under attack. From who? The wolves? I don't see anyone in there. Have I been able to do this the whole time? Oh my god. What is that? A giant wolf? Was it like a Sasquatch? What are you? It's like, oh, it's a bear. Uh oh. Oh, snap. Oh. But my boy Brand, Brand is gonna. Okay. Well, we need. We need another. We need another guy. Can we make another guy? We don't have any other guys to make. I'm afraid to take away from the food, although I have a lot of food right now, but winter is coming. <laughs> I'm just kind of thinking I've lost control of what area? That area? Oh, really? Whatever. It's all good. Uh, let's unassign the scout. And let's assign one of them guys. I just broke. Can you hurry up and get back there so I can. Alright, so now I'm gonna assign another, another uh, warrior. And we're just gonna send. Uh, pretty confident that he's gonna be able to. Get rid of them. Let's see. Let's watch this action. Boom. 
Dude, I should have done this like way long ago. Like literally in the game years ago. Dude. Dude. Yeah, alright, let's can let's get <laughs> I always do that. I always hesitate and I just try to build up my resources and like really stock up and just go annihilate everyone. And apparently I didn't need to do that. So, I don't know. It is what it is. But that's good. I should be... Why aren't you all happy? <laughs> Got a pretty good land going on. Alright, so now... now Oh, now they're colonizing it? Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> that's all I had to do. Oh my goodness. My lord, I am delighted to report that Halvard's camp is now safe from any beastly threat. Excellent, please make sure as people receive the food they need and tend to their wounded. On behalf of the Hydran clan, I would like to express our most heartfelt gratitude. We would have been doomed without you. Everyone talks just like that, apparently. From now until the end of time, you can count on the help and loyalty of the Goat clan. I hereby sudden solemnly pledge my allegiance to you. Victory! I wonder if I did any of the additional, like, objectives. I, ha I feel like I had to have. The next, what is, what is it? No, reach six happiness, I didn't do that. Destroy all wolf dens, didn't do that. Trade food and wo wood for, how about two trade routes for at least one month each. Okay. I like these bonus objectives that make go back and have you play to like do specific things because I like those kinds of things. It's like achievements, basically. Um, cool. So yeah, the story is like kind of teaching you how to play the game. It seems like, and then you have like the regular single player mode that you can play against I don't know, multiple people that you set up however you want. Um, I really, really, really love this game. I really like the way that it's set up. This is an awesome like addition to the Switch. I'm really pumped that this is finally out. Um, I've been looking forward to it and assuming that I was going to like it. And I'm really glad that of all the like ancient civilizations, they picked Vikings. Um, they're one of my favorites. And, um, excuse me. And, um, yeah, the music, the art, everything, the gameplay. I love the way they implemented it. It's a little stressful. Because <laughs> you got to, um, you know, balance your resources and stuff to make sure that everything is the way it's supposed to be. But, yeah. Um... This game is really cool. If you're a fan of RTSs, and if you, especially if you, especially if you uh, were a fan of Age of Empires and like StarCraft, those kinds of games, um, but Age of Empires especially, I guess, because it's like that kind of plot or setting. Um, yeah, this this is fun. Uh, I'm gonna play this a, a bunch. I'm gonna play Assassin's Creed. I still have to finish Astral Chain. I still have to do my video for the news and releases of September that's going to now be more archival because it's like the end of September, but I'll have it out for in case anyone wants to check out the games I find that were notable to myself and maybe other people for the month. Um, I still got to do my Comic-Con videos and I got to do a bunch of other stuff, so I will get those done, I promise. I've been busy and I, like I said, I'm feeling like really not good, like really sick kind of. And I hope I wasn't too boring sounding, uh, cause of that I tried to be chipper, and yeah. But yeah, this game is really fun. I'm gonna just go bloop out of here. Um, I'm also I got damsel. I'm gonna play that at some point and solo islands. The how I'm gonna do a first look video for those as well. Um, yeah. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Um, like, subscribe, share comment down below let me know if you got this game and if you're enjoying it let me know if you like to play age of empires because i'm a big fan and i just like to you know talk to other people who are fans of the game so thank you for watching guys and stay tuned i'll see you on the next one Bye bye